friends. Hi friends, old and new. We are Bob and Fran, healthy aging coaches and authors. We're both in our 80s and feel better than ever. Today we want to share some of our favorite books and movies that helped enable both of us to overcome devastating life-threatening illnesses by switching to a whole food plant-based lifestyle. And we saved a very special book suggestion for last, so please stick around. And let's jump right in now. The, um, you may have heard us say in the past that uh, I had an incurable autoimmune disease called myasthenia gravis. I was very sick for 14 years, went to multiple neurologists and other doctors, yeah. and was told that I could never get better, that I would be on medication the rest of my life, and that my life would be shortened. And then one day, I heard a, a clinical nutritionist speak, and he recommend reading The China Study by T. Colin Campbell. I immediately went out and got the book. Yeah, the, I think the, the interesting thing about the book is that it is the largest research study ever on the benefits of eating a whole a, food plant-based diet. Yeah. Now, let me tell you something about this book. The first chapter or two are really dry. <laughs> a lot of statistics and facts. Don't get bogged down by that. Keep reading because the rest of it is really interesting. And like I said, it literally saved our lives. Yeah. And the same nutritionist also recommend Diet for a New America by John Robbins. This too is well worth reading. Um, I, I think I just got this on the internet. It might have even been a used book. It doesn't matter. The information in it is priceless. I'd like to talk about another book that's especially important to me because it, it came into our existence after I was di uh, diagnosed with kidney cancer. And so we both were sick at the same time and we both decided at the same time that we needed to make a severe change in what we ate. And so I learned about forks over knives. We read the book and we watched this video, Forks Over Knives. The video I will never forget as long as I live. It is that powerful. We thought we were eating really healthy yeah. because basically we were eating white meat chicken, turkey, yeah. and fish. Yeah. No fried foods. And I mean, we thought we were doing really well, but obviously we were not. Um, over the uh, past few years, we were actually putting on some uh, programs in person here in our in our town and we always show this movie as, as part of as our part presentation, of our presentation. Yeah. it's yep. called what the health it's one of our and favorites it's excellent it's got great information in it and it's done in kind of a um, almost with some humor in it yeah but it's well worth watching we learned a lot from it's this a movie. very powerful and you know there are tons of other movies out there one of my favorites that I saw recently on Netflix is a movie called Sea Spiracy like conspiracy this is Sea Spiracy uh, another movie that I particularly like is called The Game Changers it's an it's a story uh, focused primarily on world-class athletes and how they became stronger and their faster. performance levels <laughs> yeah. increased. They, they ran faster, jumped higher when they switched from their, whatever their diet was to a whole food plant-based diet. Now we just saw a movie called The Need to Grow, which I believe you can see on the internet. And it shows how uh, important it is to change the, um, the quality of our soil in order to make our food supply more sustainable. And there's a, one more movie that we wanted to recommend. It's called Code Blue. And this, it's a story of a young woman physician who just as she was finishing her residency discovered that she has MS, my, um, multiple sclerosis. And she 
didn't know how she was going to continue yeah. to be a physician but until she, she changed her diet. She discovered blueberries first. Yeah, that I remember was the first that. Thing, right. And now uh, she's yeah. a, a plant-based uh, whole food plant-based yeah. uh, doctor that uh, that she has her own practice and she's become quite popular on the internet. Right. Very very so, important movie to see. So that one was called Code Blue. Yeah. Now, a couple of years ago, we were fortunate enough in our community to uh, get um, a whole food plant-based physician. And the first thing he did when we went to him the first time was give us some homework. He recommended reading Prevent and Reverse Heart Disease by, T. Cal uh, by um, Caldwell Esselstyn, Jr. Now we thought we were eating really healthy because here we're on a whole food plant-based diet. But what we didn't realize was the damage that just using uh, oil for cooking and for salad dressings was doing to us. And this book explains exactly how that can be harmful to your health and how to avoid that. It's really a, a definitely worth a read. Right, you don't have to have any heart issues to no, really learn quite right. a bit. But we also didn't want to develop any. Yeah, okay. and, and for those people out there that have a heart problem or know someone with a heart problem. Uh, this is a very valuable okay. book to excellent, read. Excellent. So okay. now about our go-to Bible. <laughs> <laughs> this is How Not to Die by Dr. Michael Greger. And as you can see, it's pretty thick, and it is like a reference for anything that you need to look up medically because he covers just about any subject in this book that you could think of with excellent solutions to medical problems yeah, with the and diet. And he, he's also uh, written a couple more since then. I, yeah. I think he's written a cookbook that we have, uh, yeah. that we have in the house and that we enjoy as well. Speaking of cookbooks, there are loads of, of plant-based cookbooks on the market, but we have this one that we'd like to share with you. It's called Plant-Based Cooking by Jill and Jeffrey Dalton, and they have um, a YouTube channel called The Whole Food Plant-Based Cooking Show, and Jill is a fantastic cook and baker. I want to tell you that uh... We, we recommend the book, not only because it's a great book, but these folks have helped us so much. Uh, they reached, they have a very large following. They reached out to us with our little tiny following, <laughs> and they've been just uh, extraordinary people and very kind. And now for the last book we recommend. What could that be? Well, it's one that <laughs> yours truly, Bob and Fran, uh, both wrote together called 101 Ways to Be Young at Any Age. So this is a, is a book you can buy on Amazon. I think it's a $12 or so. All the money goes to uh, uh, fight child trafficking. And it is a uh, compilation of articles that we have written over time. Uh, and it's packed with ideas to keep young, to uh, Grow younger instead of older. It's sort of our philosophy. We advise you to read only one or two chapters a day and let, and sort of absorb them. And uh, it even has some good recipes in it. Yeah, there. it does, and it makes for a great gift as well. So we hope you found these books and movies to be uh, helpful. We use them, and uh, they've benefited us tremendously. So we hope that uh, you will take time out to uh, comment in the uh, comment section below. And I know that uh, if you haven't subscribed, you will, and you will share this video hopefully as well. And we look forward to seeing you again very, very soon. soon. Bye, Bye for now. now. Thank you.